The St. Kitts and Nevis Pharmacy Association, in collaboration with the Ministry of Health, will, from October 18th to the 24th, host Pharmacy Week. The occasion is designed to educate persons on the role pharmacists play in the country. The theme this year is Pharmacy for a Better Tomorrow. Chief Pharmacist for St. Kitts and Nevis, Vanessa Matthew, spoke to SK Newsline about the week of activities. We will be starting out with a church service by the Antioch Baptist Church. We'll also be having virtual seminars which will take place on the 19th, the 21st, and the 23rd, that's the Monday, Wednesday, and, and Friday. And we have, we plan it for in the evening when most of us are at home finishing up work. So it gives everybody a chance to be there. And I'm really happy for the fact that we are now facilitating virtual, virtual meetings, virtual seminars, because it takes persons from all walks of life, from different time zones to actually be part of many activities and it makes it so much easier. So this is part of what we are also going to do. And on Saturday, we are having our fun day. Ms. Matthew noted that it is the hope that the activities this week will educate the public more on the important role of pharmacies and pharmacists. My intention or the intention of the association is to, is to bring awareness to the Federation about the function of pharmacy in a broad sense. We, uh, we have prepared a flyer which we hope would be very informative to not just the adult population but also to our young people because with that with that flyer, we have outlined the different branches of pharmacy. We have outlined the, the, the definition, exactly what is a pharmacist, what is, what's the, the job for a pharmacist, I mean, the job description for a pharmacist. We have even included the opportunities for learning. You know, if you want to be a technician, where can you go if you want to practice or study to be a pharmacist? What are the options there? Pharmacy Week will be observed by pharmacy staff in both the public and the private sectors. Andre Huey, SKN Newsline.